it's Shira, and so today, um, I, I just go went home from school. So I'm really excited because today I'm going to make the video that has been really highly requested, which is a homemade squishy. And I'm using this memory foam that I got from Rock and Roll Slime. And this is so good for making squishy because not only slow raising, it's also okay. I'm gonna show it there. It's also like. I don't know, it's like so soft, it's not like normal foam. Yeah. It's really good to make a panda bun because you don't need to paint the white again. And so if you want to search my foam for your squishy, you can totally buy it at Rock and Roll Slime at Instagram. So please check it out. So now I'm going to just change my clothes and let's go to the tutorial. Okay, so this is basically what you need. You need is like scissors some foam of course i'm using the foam that i bought from rock and roll slime and if you're not using these kind of foam which is already soft at the top you should color your foam white next is some paint i recommend puffy paint but because i cannot find puffy paint here so i use watercolors paint and that's basically things that you need so now let's just start well, I'm sorry I forgot to mention this is take something circular and draw a, a circle on your foam. I'm done tracing the foam so now I'm going to cut it. As I know this is not um the, okay so this is how mine turned out. And so now we're going to make the face. Or for you guys who don't have the soft one, you can paint it. Yay! I'm going to paint the sides first. I'm going to take a white paint. Okay guys, so this is how my paint event turned out. And sorry if it looks quite messy because when I paint this, my brother which is still three years old, wanted to paint this, so it's quite bad. And also, I forgot to film it because my brother took it over. So sorry for that, so now we're going to let it dry. Sorry for a really bad face, I mean like really bad. Actually, my first time making a squishy. And also, another thing is, um, my brother actually squeezed all of them when they have been dry, so you may see some fingerprints here. But the most one that affected with my brother is the panda bun. So sorry for that. There's a heart to you. Okay, so this is how the texture is. And in this video, there's going to be a lot of my brother voice in the back. So sorry for that. And so this is my homemade squishy, and you may see there's some paint all over, that's also my brother, so, yeah. This is my paint bun again. It's actually very slow rising, but, well, I don't really like the, there's like a bunch of paint around it. And yeah, but this is so soft and slow rising. And this is the rainbow cake I made. This is slow raising also, and I'm sorry if I squish it quite cringy because I just realized that it haven't dried fully, so you may see by my hands. This is also from a leftover piece. 